Mike Pagliarulo spent his first five and a half major league seasons in pinstripes, serving as the Yankees' third baseman in the mid and late 1980s. He signed with the Twins as a free agent in 1991, and that year, he won the World Series. Now, fresh off his induction into the New York State Baseball Hall of Fame, we welcome him in now. And Mike, first question, please describe what being a for member, forever member rather now, of the New York State Baseball Hall of Fame means for you. Well, I'll tell you, I was um, I was extremely honored. Um, I was flattered and uh, and grateful. I mean, there were so many people that I uh, that I was part of in, in, in my career, and then being inducted with uh, Tino Martinez and Lou Pinella was just a super thrill for me. It was um, you know something that I'll never forget. Um, it was um, you know, and and I had uh, the whole family was there, so it was great. It was uh, it was just a special special. Uh, day and um, you know it's a great uh, it's a great organization and you know I heard a couple of years ago it was uh, you know Ron Gibby was there and I uh, traveled out uh, to see Gator and also Billy Martin Mickey Mantle so it's uh, it's a great thrill and certain certainly something I'll never forget and um, um, like I said I'm just honored and flattered and I was I was so excited it was a great night Certainly well deserved. Your speech was tremendous. You were drafted by the Yankees in the sixth round, 1981, called up in 84. Of course, your debut must have been special. What other memories stand out for you while you were in a Yankees uniform? Tell us about a couple of them. Well, there's really so many. I mean, that's where I was born into baseball. And, um, uh, you know, you know, being from Boston, you know, you're really not too fond of the Yankees, but honestly the uh, the Yankees had so many professionals in the organization we had we had the greatest owner in, in, in baseball and every year the team was trying to win and so it was uh, they were rebuilding at the time but it was great it was a great uh, situation for me to be in although following following nettles wasn't the easiest thing in the world <laughs> you know he was he was awesome he was a, a great man and, and was great to me could have made it a lot more difficult <laughs> but um, but being in pinstripes there was so many so many times it was tremendous I just, I guess, one situation that, that I, comes to mind is when we were in, uh, we we're fighting for the, for first place, and it was late in September, and we we're playing Toronto, and um, my gosh, Gator was, Gator was starting this one game, and um, I think we were just one or two games behind. Gator was starting this one game, and. You know, the first hitter got up, he struck him out, struck out the next two guys, and the, the stadium was packed. First time I had been in the packed Yankee Stadium. And then and then the next inning, he goes out there and strikes out the next three. Well, I'll tell you, I was running off the field. I felt like I was carried off the field. It was just a dead-out sprint right into the dugout. It was uh, it was so exciting. I got goosebumps running on and off the field. It was, um, you know, it was things like that that uh, just pop in your head now and then. And one of the greatest things about playing for the Yankees is just a thrill. And, um, you know, I, I, I tried to play as best I can and, and was very proud to play for New York. And I know when I saw you on Sunday, you were in the midst of celebrating the 30-year anniversary of the 1991 Twins World Series Championship. That must have been fun. Yeah, that was, that was great. It was, um, it was a special uh, group of guys that, you know, it was interesting. 1991, you know, we came in last place the year before, and I didn't realize that. And also Atlanta had come in last place the year before. It was a great thing for baseball. Um, but but not only that, you know, that, that team, it, I think we proved to everyone that you don't have the most have to have the most talent to win. Um, best teams win. And we definitely had the best team. It was a group of guys that got together, very unselfish play, and had a lot of fun. Um, but played the game every day. You know, ran all the balls out and played everything. And we, of course, we had great coaches too, and a super manager. That manager, I, I kind of likened to uh, Billy and, and Lou. You know, uh, three of the greatest managers ever. And uh, I was fortunate to play for him and learned a lot from him. Um, but I, and our staff helped with the whole team. Everyone pitched in all the time. It was a very, very fun year. But once a Yankee, forever a Yankee. Correct. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Thank you. you know, I go, I, I go around it. No matter, I can win my World Series ring, but I'm the Yankee guy, no matter where I go. Fantastic. That's, that's it. Mike, thank you so much. Always great to see you, and congratulations. All the best. Thank you very much. Okay. Thanks, Nancy.